Might put like a little sound clip. What's up, guys? Tony here. And Dan. Then Tony Hookah, Hookah Pro Rock on. Bring you guys another sushi review. I want to put like a little sound clip. Tangier is cool strawberry. <laughs> I don't have the container with me. It's upstairs. I don't feel like getting it. Being lazy today, I guess. It's it's the same exact cut from the orange soda, so we can just show you that. Yeah, I'll show you Same that. juiciness and everything. Juiciness. I don't know what's the point of showing you the wrong tobacco, but whatever. No, it looks exactly the same. Yeah, it does. Yep, the same exact thing. It's, it's actually not as juicy as other tangiers that we've encountered. Yeah, in that day. both tin, uh, orange soda and cool strawberry aren't, aren't that that wet compared to comparable to other not comparable to other ones. Yep, um, and it smelled like strawberries. No duh. Um, kind of had like a small little um, tobacco undertone. That's alright. It's guess. expected. Yeah. It's unwashed. Um, it also, I don't know why I got this, but it kind of smelled like there was like alcohol in it. The smell, at least. You could smell like, like when you smelled it, it kind of burnt your nostrils because it, it was it felt like an alcoholic smell. It doesn't taste like that though. That's just how it smelled. I don't know. Clouds are a nine. Yeah. It's not as juicy, so I don't think the clouds are going to be as big as But we also have two coals. This, actually, I, I noticed this, I already noticed this is a little bit heat sensitive because it's two coals and it is kind of tickly and the clouds aren't that big. Yep, so we have it in the KM Tremogal part with the Alien Bowl. Um, two Coco Chronicle, Good. Chronicle Naturals in the Lotus. Um, fancy new hose. Yeah. Fancy new hose. I think it's funny they're called fancy hoses, but they're totally not fancy at all. <laughs> Opposite of fancy hose. Um, so yeah. It tastes like... It's like a very natural strawberry. Actually, the clouds are pretty big now. We actually pretty much just started this bowl. We've been smoking it for like probably 15 minutes. Yeah, just a... And that five, five minutes of that was nothing because of the lotus. Yeah, so 10 minutes technically. Um... So yeah, it tastes like like a very natural strawberry. You can still taste the um, tobacco undertone a little bit. It it actually tastes like you took a bite of a strawberry. But I want to point out, I don't the thing one thing I don't like about this flavor is it leaves a weird aftertaste in your mouth. At least for me. We smoked this once last night. No, was it last night or two nights ago? It was two, two nights, nights ago. ago. And uh, it was the day we got it, so I probably wasn't acclimated all the way. But um. Anth and Tori both said that it tasted like diarrhea smell. Which as is weird really as that, as really, as weird as that sounds. It doesn't taste bad anymore. I didn't get that for some reason. I don't know why. It was the aftertaste. The aftertaste is still kind of wonky. Wonky, but it's still like a really good flavor. It's a really good strawberry flavor. But I just I want to drink something while I smoke it because I don't like yeah. the aftertaste. Um, do you really taste any cooling effect? Um. Actually, in the aftertaste, I don't like the aftertaste, but like after you exhale, you can kind of feel, your mouth kind of feels a little bit cool, but in the actual smoke, it, it doesn't ever really have a cooling effect. Which I was kind of surprised by. Usually when Tangiers wants to do something, they do it. Yeah, like if they want like a cooling effect, they're going to give you a cooling effect. Yeah. But not in this one. Maybe it's not supposed to be. Maybe it's supposed to be like a... Maybe it's just supposed to be like a... Natural. Like, like it's supposed to be like a strawberry, because you don't... How often do you eat a strawberry that's warm? Right, exactly. Because usually people refrigerate them. Yeah. Maybe like, I'm thinking like cool strawberry means like natural strawberry as opposed to a candy strawberry. Yeah. Maybe, I don't know. Um, but yeah, it tastes like, it tastes like you're eating like a regular old strawberry. It, it's actually pretty impressive because I feel like strawberry is one of those flavors that's really hard to, to pinpoint naturally. Yeah. As opposed to, I feel like most strawberry flavors would be candy-ish. Yeah, this one actually isn't too, isn't, isn't like overly sweet. Yeah. The strawberries are sweet. But a lot of the time they're like really tart. Mm. 
unless you have like a really really good strawberry. Um. So yeah, heat management. We gotta say medium. Yeah. Cause it's kind of heat sensitive. How long did we smoke this last time? We only did one round. Then we smoked something else. I think. Yeah, because that weird taste. Actually, I don't think we smoked something else. I think that was the end of it. Okay. The end of the night. I don't know. But it's so much better than it was last time. Mm -hmm. But, um, yeah, longevity, shit, man, I don't know. An hour and a half, an hour and 45 minutes, I guess. In the alien, yeah. Yeah. Um, flavor, flavor accuracy we can do for this, too. I think it's, if you're doing, like, a natural strawberry, if it's accurate to that, it would be, like, a, like a nine and a half out of ten. It's pretty yeah. accurate. It is pretty accurate. And overall, I'm going to say... I don't know. Oh, we didn't say intensity, actually. Oh, um. Accuracy. I mean, intensity. I don't know. It's not that strong, but it is pretty strong. I'll give it like a seven and a half. Yeah, I'd say say seven and a half. It's not that strong, but it is pretty strong. Yeah, I'd give it a, definitely a seven and a half, because it's like a good... It's a good, like... I wouldn't say even balance, because it's not... There's nothing to balance, but, like... It is, like, a solid intensity, if yeah. you know what I mean by that. Like, it's not too intense. It's not, like, you can't taste it. Also, I'd like to note this would be a really good mixer. Yeah, definitely. We haven't mixed it yet. Well, you make, like, a... You kind of make, like, a smoothie, smoothie thing. If you got, like, a... If, you, if we had... We have strawberry kiwi left. We could mix this with strawberry kiwi. Just, like, a little bit of this. Because the strawberry and strawberry kiwi isn't... I mean... The strawberry in strawberry kiwi isn't prominent. Yeah, I think the kiwi is more prominent in that flavor, so I think... If you mix this 50-50 with the strawberry kiwi, this would be fucking delicious. It, it like, enhance the strawberry kiwi. It, yeah. it enhanced the strawberry and strawberry kiwi. Yeah. And it'd be, like, a strawberry kiwi smoothie. Maybe if you add, like... Vanilla? Yeah, like a tiny bit. Of some sort of vanilla we should flavor. Get a, we should get a Tangier's vanilla flavor. Yeah, we should. So, yeah, overall... I don't know how I feel about this flavor. It does have a pretty strong uh, tobacco undertone, which isn't awful. I mean, it's unwashed, so you kind of really expect that. So I'm going to say uh, seven and a half. Last time we smoked it, I would have given it like a five. <laughs> but this time, I'm going to give it an eight. Wow. Three points up. It's real good. I would have given it a higher rating if it didn't have that aftertaste. Because <clears throat> it is like, like, for example, <laughs> I don't know, I just don't, something about it is just weird. Yeah, I don't know, man. It doesn't taste like an aftertaste of a strawberry. I'll yeah. tell you that, I'll tell you that much. But yeah, that's about it. Tangier's Cool Strawberry. Thanks for watching. Oh, shit. <laughs>